guys! Welcome back to Holly Scoops Just Saying. I'm Heather Gardner. I'm Stephanie Gray. Today we're talking about Camila Cabello and a little controversy she has gotten herself into. And let me just say, it has nothing to do with Earth Harmony, so at least there's that. It's kind of refreshing, <laughs> if you ask me. Kind of. All right, so she was performing last night. She's been doing her brand new single, Crying in the Club. Yes. Love that song. Do you like that no song? No crying in the club. That, Camila does it so much better. Sorry, Stephanie. <laughs> but you like, do you like the song? Uh, yeah, I I need to hear it a few more times. Yeah, it's catchy, it's yeah. poppy, it's a good first song. I hope there's more. Like, I like the her. message, no yeah. crying in the club, because you know that when you're in the club or even a friggin' bar and you see that drunk girl who's crying, it's just like, <laughs> That's really go sad. home, That's a get it kill. together. <laughs> yeah, no crying, in the, in, no crying in the club. So she's been performing this song a ton since the Billboard Music Awards a few weeks ago. That was her big debut. Yeah. So she was over in Britain last night yes. for Britain's Got Talent, and she performed. But Twitter, hmm, they didn't like it so much. No. People straight up thought she lip synced, and I'll tell you the reason why. The performance was elaborate, and although she wasn't pulling some crazy dance moves, right. she was doing a lot of head spins, and then the right. arms, and then going down to the ground, and another thing, uh -huh. and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And then at the same time, there's like pyrotechnics, and fire, and all this stuff, and she was still perfectly on key. Mm -hmm. And people were like, it's too good to be true. <laughs> Isn't that terrible? Nobody's that good, nobody! It's so sad. Okay, so I watched it. Yeah. I did too. What did you think? I think, well, you, you go first, you go first. Okay, I love how you said that it was like perfect because I thought it was pitchy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching it, I, I watched like the beginning part where there wasn't as much like dancing and stuff around. Yeah. And it did seem a little off, like her little, you know how singers like, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. They do their little head. That's little. how Heather makes out, by the way. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> oh, now all you know. All my secrets have been divulged. Anyway, so they do their little thing. It did seem a little off, but I thought she wasn't lip syncing because it was just a little pitchy to me. Nothing bad. Like, all singers go through this, even the world class singers. Yeah. This happens. It's not a big deal, but I was like, that can't be lip sync because it's not perfect. Right. But by the time she got to the dancing, it was getting a little too perfect. Okay, so here, so I think either her publicist or some spokesperson, mm -hmm. someone on behalf of Camilla. Camila mm -hmm. spoke out. Sorry. <laughs> and, Camila! <laughs> Camila! Someone spoke out uh, on her behalf and they said, look, there's three vocals to the song, okay? Mm -hmm. So there's like the chorus, the background stuff, and then the main vocals. Right. And she was doing the main vocals, but yes, lip synced in the background is like the chorus and stuff like that. So what, during the pyrotechnic stuff, and especially when she was really dancing on the floor and getting right. all up in there, that's when it was mostly the chorus. So yes, I think she was lip syncing in that particular moment, but it was supposed to be the lip synced part. Yeah. Does that make sense? I mean, a lot of singers do this. Justin Bieber has fallen on stage, Mike goes flying, and he's yeah. still perfectly on pitch, and you know he's like on the ground. Like you Britney know he's Spears. lip syncing. Yes, Britney Spears. There was that this. whole thing. I mean, she was freaking going to town with these dance numbers. Mm -hmm. You can't do that, guys. Go take a jog, okay, and then try to belt out a song. I can't even shower and loop but up my body see, and sing But at the same see, time. you can because I've heard of singers. I I feel like this was Taylor Swift actually who said this. She, some singers like sing on the treadmill to actually Practice build. Doing yeah, it. to actually build up a tolerance of cardio, which is the dancing, and singing at the same time. Hmm. I'm sorry, but if you're a world class singer, I really don't ever think there's a reason for you to lip sync. If you're sick, just don't do it. I just right. don't ever well, think What was so. the controversy with someone lip syncing on like It was like Ashley a... Simpson on SNL. Yes, on SNL! Ah, yes, you guys! Who can forget? That was, that ages us. Because that, that was, was like 15 years yeah, ago. Yeah, <laughs> sorry, but that was... That was bad. So bad. But I'm just saying, like, he, singers do lip sync, and I understand that it's oftentimes not their choice. Like, the Super Bowl is oftentimes lip sync because it's just you too big of a production to mess it up. Right. But at the same time, I just never like it, and I never appreciate it. I'm yeah. not going to falter for it if she did it, but I still don't like it. My stance is, if you're dancing a lot, you can lip sync. You're allowed. If you're just standing there, <laughs> you girl, you better just belt that out. Or if you can't, then don't perform. The end. Jeez. Either way, don't perform. That's what we get from yeah. this. Do not don't. perform. Stay in bed. All right. <laughs> let us know if you saw the performance and what your initial thoughts were. Then go back and watch it, and then let us know what you thought again mm -hmm. after knowing mm -hmm. what we know. All right. Subscribe to our channel also, and we'll see you back here tomorrow, guys. Later, gang. Bye.